Come on in. Make yourself at home. After seeing her other tattoo, I had an idea for something Emily's gonna love. Her burger boy's about to get the ax in more ways than one. When I saw this other piece that you have, it made me do a little research on the seal of Brooklyn, because you were talking about going to Brooklyn, and I thought, what a better way to do that, because then it would actually play off of that really, really well. That Something sounds like great, that. yeah. Okay, go to work. You don't miss cheeseburger guy? No, not one I bit. I didn't think you would. I'm a vegetarian. <laughs> Okay? Yeah. We are all most done. That's it. Why don't you sit up? What do you think? <gasps> oh my god! That's awesome. She just looks so kick-ass. I love it. Cheeseburger guy has disappeared from Emily's arm. Oh my gosh. I used the seal of Brooklyn for inspiration to fully incorporate the shape of the old tattoo. The fro is hidden in the woman's chest, and his body is covered up by the folds in the dress. In the original seal, she's holding the ax upright, but I modified it to swing downward. Not only does it completely cover up the burger, those ugly lines from the original tattoo look like the motion of a swinging ax. What began out of necessity now looks like a bold, creative decision. So awesome, because now I have where I'm from and where I want to go. See, now you just got to get out to Brooklyn and show it off. I know, right? <laughs> now Emily's tattoo is about where she wants to go, instead of some ugly guy who can't stop thinking about a cheeseburger with bacon and extra pickles. Hey, when's lunch? All right, let's get out of here. After you.